Hey everyone, welcome again to another War Jeepney Battle Report and we are playing Bushido and I am playing against uh, Carlo and his newly acquired Jung and I'll be using my Ito clan, I'm John by the way and we'll be playing K, the scenario that has six shrines that you have to pray to and this is 100 rice. Right now we already have deployed at our edges you notice our map is a little bit uh, larger than uh, two feet, so that's why we had to deploy them a little bit in. But I'm running Lords of Izu, and I have my Izu Serpents, I have Kiyo, I have Ishi. I'm using Matsunagi with Itsunagi's Gambit. I have a Temple Bushi, a Jade Mamba Guard, and I have Itsunagi that has Fork Tongue to give him six cents. And my other snake is there at the other side. Over at his side, he's running Jung Pirates. And can you please give us a rundown on your list, sir? Okay, so I'm playing Jung Pirates, led by Jung Marie. And Jung this Marie. Is, uh, in a Queen of the Waves theme, her personal theme. So it gives. Uh, uh, she gives a uh, scout to her Kaizokus, which is Juri, uh, Akohanin. And here in. Uh, and also, she's with. Uh, with her first mate, her Juin, Fujiwara Run, and I also have a cameo reflection. And over here, because of the... I believe you have some guys in flank. Yes, in flank, there's uh, Arata, and there's also Yori. Yori and Arata are in uh, deploying from the flank. He already has noted that. And we will begin with our initiative roll for the first turn. I don't have any tactician. Do you have... Any tactician? tactician there? No, no tactician, so I make a five. Make a two. Makes a two, and I will let him activate first. And we are here now at the middle of turn one. So over here at the left side of the board, I have a cobra. I have Chiyo by one shrine over there, and I have a boa uh, right in front of his. Kami of the... what's that? Reflection. Kami of Reflection. Uh, I have Matsunagi over here and you can still activate. He is only tired. I have Itsunagi, still only tired. I have a Temple Bushi and a Jade Mamba Guard, Jade Mamba Guard here by the middle objective and I have a snake over here at the edge. And here he has most of his guys uh, clumped up going towards my right side that includes Jung Marie and uh, Kaizokus over there. And right now I'm activating uh, Ishii who has walked and is attempting to shoot Jung Marie. So we will make a range test for that one. So he used his uh, bodyguard trait and switched Jung Marie and the bodyguard. What's the name of that bodyguard? Uh, Fujiwaru Ran. Fujiwaru Ran. And I will need a 6 to hit since the bodyguard ran. So we need 6s for my range attack. And I miss. So that is that. So turn 1 ends without any event. I tried to make a range attack but missed. So for my re remaining activations, I just move Matsunagi up the bridge. And I move Itsunagi over here into a position of threat. And hopefully that does something. But anyway, we are starting now with turn 2. And we are rolling for turn 2 initiative. I have my dice here. I make a 4. And he makes a 1. So I am going for the turn. Just spend 3 key and you remove the death sentence. So that's what Itsunagi does. So Carlo plays Kamikaze that allows him to move two of his models within one inch and not into an opponent's zone of control. So he moves Jung Mari and Juri. And Juri. So his models come in by flank. Over here we have Arata, correct? Yep, Arata. Arata and this Yori. guy's Yori, the Yori comes at uh, my right flank. So for my first activation, I activate my Izu Serpents. I make my Cobra and Boa uh, handle that Kami of Reflection there. I don't know if that was a good idea. And I'm using my Ass Snake to go ahead and engage Arata over here at the edge just to disrupt his activations. 
So let's start first with uh, the cobra snake. Mm -hmm. uh, no, actually, let's start first with the. Yeah, let's start with the cobra snake first, who will attack the kami. Mm -hmm. My cobra snake has uh, one. Mm -hmm. I have two. Kami reflection has two. You have two. Uh, gang uh, insignificant doesn't count for gang up, so I just go on defense. What is that? Defense. Defense to defense, so <laughs> nothing happens. Okay, so your back now turns, mm -hmm. and we will resolve the bow attack. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. and I go and attack. One defense, one attack. One defense, one attack. I make a four, he defends. Six. Strikes with a two. Mm -hmm. Okay, so roll your damage, your 2d6 damage. Camera reflection has plus zero. Plus zero. But has sharp, but I think that doesn't have Yeah, top. doesn't have uh, top anyway. So that's seven. And the boa is killed. We now proceed over to my snake. My asp over there versus Arata. Okay. And I have here my single and one and only dice. Arata is running on... Three dice. Three dice. So. Okay, so let's go on defense. He's got two on attack. Green is his attack. I defend for three. Oh, it's a double one. Fails the yes. attack. Yes. And that's how it worked for me. No prowess. Walang prowess, Billy C. No. No, no prowess, Billy. No okay. So, Arata is tired. Mm -hmm. uh, the Kami is exhausted, and my snakes are tired. Arata is impetuous yep. and aggressive and kill my snake. Mm -hmm. So we'll have a melee exchange. I'm just defending. So two dice so because I'm not aggressive. That's three to two. So it's success. Uh, Reroll this. I, uh, you don't have a... I don't have an attack. I only made a two for my defense. You made a three. 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 So one in killed. I thought it was going to tie him up. Unfortunately, it didn't. I'll activate Itsunagi mm -hmm. and I'll walk five and engage both models right here in the middle. So we resolve the split attack first between Itsunagi and Kohanin. Mm -hmm. I have three dice. I'm not really doing anything. Okay, so go combo attack. You're all on defense. Yep. So I have a six. Seven. He's a seven, so... Uh, I have no feint there, so nothing I can do with that. Mm -hmm. And we'll now resolve an attack against Duri. So he spends two key and boost to four dice. I spend my only two key and boost to four dice. Mm -hmm. And I'll go combo attack. All defense. All defense. Yeah. I'm a four, five, six. 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 So at zero, hitting at zero. So for my first attack at zero, I have a sword plus one. Uh, oh, three damage, three that's damage. plus one. Three damage. three damage. And my next uh, zero attack for the combo attack is... That is actually one damage. One damage. So yes. four damage. So total of four damage to that guy. And Itsunagi is now tired. So during his activation, he's playing uh, Blow the Man Down. And I have to make a size challenge. Test six on Itsunagi. And he is blown. blown down, so what happens? He is blown down three inches away from any direction and becomes prone. Okay, so he is prone and moved. Three so inches. Itsunagi is pushed three inches here and is now prone. So he's activating Jung Marie and is provoking my we snake. To, we have to make an opposed key. Snake of one, I make a two and my snake is now impetuous. Uh, impetuous. Kaizoku within six inches. It's a simple action, so she will uh, she will just gain one uh, remove one activation marker. Using command on the Kaizoku. Yep. On my on Kaizoku within six inches. So how many can she command? Three. So these two. Okay. She's going to shoot its Nagi <laughs> going to shoot Itsunagi. Okay. So that mm -hmm. needs a five to shoot Itsunagi. Oh, and that is an 8, so that is 3 damage in. 3 damage in, actually plus 2. Uh, 3 damage is rolling for the... Oh wait, hold on, hold on. Uh, well, too bad I rolled. Forgot I have a 
a bodyguard. Oh, bodyguard. Okay. I have a bodyguard. Hmm. So, uh, I would have just swapped that. But this bodyguard. Uh, let's check. Let's check the focus on the camera there. I forgot about <laughs> the reason why I brought this girl in the first place. So yeah, I will switch. So it's an Agi. Being prone, rolls. <laughs> rolls over to the other side. Rolls over to the other side. Yeah, so for you rules makers, you gotta think about that. <laughs> that my guy just rolled all the way there. Prone, and the Jade Mamba Guard is now the new target. He's no longer prone, but doesn't have the range to defense. Mm -hmm. So he was hitting on fours. I, I, not threes, uh, fours. Four, so now that's four in. Four in. Yes. That makes it four in. Okay, so roll for your damage. I have ar uh, armor two. You have uh, uh, I have weapons. Pierce two. So your armor means nothing. <laughs> Pierce too, so my armor is nothing. So rolling for the damage. Rolling for the damage. So that's four, five, six. Six, seven, eight. I, I believe plus the two. plus two. Eight, eight is still uh, plus zero. Mm -hmm. So my Jade Mamba Guard gets four damage. My next one, uh, the next model is going to move is. It's now activating the other. Uh, Kaizuku. Uh, Kaizuku. Uh, yeah. yeah. In. So he will just. Move. He is engaging the prone Itsunagi. Okay, so I am at three dice. He is at three dice. I have one on attack. I have He's one on attack and two on defense. <laughs> one on attack and two on defense. So I'll make my roll. I have seven on death. I have a defense of six and an attack of six. Defense of seven and an attack on three, so we both. Don't defense do of seven. <laughs> And an attack of three. Yep. So yeah, nothing happens. nothing happens. He made my Cobra impetuous, so I guess I have to activate it. So I'm activating my Cobra, and I'll have a uh, melee attack against that Kami. I am running on one dice. The Kami is exhausted. Uh, yes. So, so we're also running on one dice. Okay, so here we go. I'm going on attack. Attack. <laughs> He's going on attack also. He will probably kill my snake. Six. I made a two. So it's durable, so, so I'm I dealing one damage. one damage, unless I make a bad damage roll here, which is no, so I deal one damage and it will kill my snake, so my snake is dead. So he's activating again Jungmari to make an opposed test on my Temple Bushi. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I Temple Bushi has one dice for key. And I have two. He has two. I make a four. I make a seven. So my temple bushi is now impetuous. impetuous. So he's activating Jung Marie to shoot uh, Matsunagi over there. He needs a four to hit. Yep, I have three dice. She has three dice. dice. Needing fours. And that is an eight. Eight. So base of four damage. Base of four damage. So okay. rolling for the damage. Does it have a pierce? Pierce 2. Pierce 2, armor 2, so armor 2 is gone. So all in. All in. So this is a damage roll. It's a 9. I think 9 to kill. Yep, so 5, 6, 7, plus 2, 8, 9. 9, so Matsunagi's head was blown, blown away. <laughs> Impetuous Temple Bushi will activate, go all the way around here. And go ahead and attack. Uh, that guy over. So no one spends anything. I'm just going all on attack. All on defense. All on defense for him. I have still have dodge because I need the applications. So, so I four. make a four and five. Five makes a five, so I'm dealing zero damage. Mm -hmm. Zero damage, and the six is zero damage. So no damage. Nothing. Nada. Activating Ran, shooting my. Uh, Jade down Mamba. to one life, Jade Mamba Guard on three dice. Three dice, so three needs, of four. needs of four. I hope he rolls all ones. <laughs> yeah, and Five. that is a uh, six, so two in. Two in. Uh, your weapon is plus two. Uh, and pierce. So he and pierce, armor. so no armor. So, so let's make the damage roll just to see what, what happens damage. anyway. Damage, so yeah, damage so roll. damage roll. Uh, yeah, so Jade Mamba Guard is dead. I'm activating Ishii. And I'm gonna make a charge action to engage that guy over there at uh, my rear. I have to tie him up or else he's going to uh, come over and beat up uh, Itsunagi. 
he spends an ability to give himself a sidestep defense. Zero. Zero. I'm going uh, one defense, two attack. Yes. Two defense, one attack. Two defense and one attack. So I make my roll. So that's I, a, I suck. So that's a uh, seven yeah. on defense, three on attack. So uh, he blocks my attack and uh, does three damage to me. So three damage plus your damage roll. Is a uh, three. Ah, for damage uh, roll. Damage roll, yeah. Damage roll. So damage base roll. of three. Base of three. So that is a nine. Nine. No, no pluses. So does four damage to uh, my girl over there. And has bleed now. And has bleed, so she's dying <laughs> at the end of the turn because of that uh, bleed action. So it didn't go well for me over there. So it makes a sidestep defense to uh, surpass my gal over there. And it's now his activation. Moving Yori, four inches. And he's going to attempt a rage attack on Kitsunagi. So he moves this guy there to hit Kitsunagi. Mm -hmm. Five uh, to hit on three dice. Yep. Since his, his weapon's lightweight, so it's five to hit. Five to hit on three dice. It's a six, seven, eight. That is an eight. That is a three in. But he has to roll uh, for being base to base with his guy there. Mm -hmm. So on three dice, you need a six. You need a six. <laughs> and he makes it. Yeah, okay, so that was three in on the ranged attack and makes a damage roll on Itsunagi. So three and a four does not have a plus harpoon. No, no plus, no plus. So that's minus one, so deals two damage to Itsunagi. And he is also bleeding. Two damage to Itsunagi and, and he is bleeding, bleeding badly. <laughs> bleed one. Is that bleed one? Bleed one. Bleed one. Bleed one. Okay. So I activate my Temple Bushi and I'm attacking uh, that guy over there. Mm -hmm. uh, nothing spent. I'm going all on attack. All on defense. All on defense. I make a five and a six. I am a five. Five, so I am one in. One in. Six. And that's a ten, so that's two in. Two in. Two in and the poison one. Poison because one. Because I have a poison one sword. It's activating Ran. So that's and is running. running. Four. One, two, three, four, so six. Right. Run six. You can ignore uh, it's Nagi because he's prone. Mm -hmm. And she runs over there. Mm -hmm. And is that your last activation? Yes, sir? that's my last activation. This is turn two, correct? Turn two, yes. Okay, so for my activation, I will just make a uh, Chiyo Prey mm -hmm. on that one. Mm -hmm. And I'll make her get rid of this Kami who is faced the other direction. Mm -hmm. For my next activation, I'll move forward mm -hmm. and make a melee exchange against that guy. It's surprised and exhausted, so I get plus one dice. Mm -hmm. So I'll just go all in attack. Okay, He's got defense. I make a 6 7, oh, I make a 1. So well, I don't have to roll anymore. I kill it, but I get one, one damage reflected back to me because that is a Kami of reflection. So this girl with the bow dies because of bleed. So she is gone. Who else has bleed over there? Uh, Itsunagi takes one bleed damage. Mm -hmm. So it takes one bleed damage. And I have one poison on my Kohanin. He's got one poison on that guy, so that guy gets one damage. One damage. Okay, so I win a VP for being the only one that prayed here. Uh, Itsunagi is still prone and he's down to one because he got dealt three damage and he's bleeding. And now we start with turn three and we roll four initiative. I make a two and he goes first with a four. So he's activating Jungberry and is uh, using her feet to make my Temple Bushi impetuous. Mm -hmm. Post key test. I make a one and my Temple Bushi is now impetuous. And I believe you are using, uh, what's that? Uh, her command trait. Her command so she's trait. going to command these two Kaizokus, Kohanin and Duri. So first I'll go with Kohanin. He's going to attack Itsunagi. Okay, three on Itsunagi and three on me. Mm -hmm. I'm prone. Yes, uh, that all attack. All attack. I have two in defense and one on attack. Let's get rid of that dice there. Okay. And here we go. Uh, let's... Okay, let's consolidate our dice. Mm -hmm. I made 
one on attack. So I made six, seven, eight. Uh, I have. Do you have anything that rerolls? No. Uh, no rerolls. Uh, I still have my dodge. So reroll the six, please. The six. Still a six. <laughs> still a six. Uh, that's six, seven, eight. Uh, yeah. But I, I don't think it will matter. If I pro is this, it's still a six. That's still dealing two damage to me. So make a damage roll in the hopes that he'll roll a three. And it also has bleed. Or uh, two. <laughs> and has bleed. <laughs> and Itsunagi is killed. And the Temple Bushi is impetuous. Mm -hmm. So for killing his uh, lord, you'll have to attack uh, that guy over oh, there. Oh yeah, what you forgot there is that Jury uh, reloads. Mm -hmm. And I'm now activating my Temple Bushi. And I'm engaging that guy in the melee exchange. I am spending my 3 key to buy dice. So it's a three dice, I didn't do anything. I bought uh, one, boosted by one. So one attack, two defense? One attack, two defense. I have three attack and one defense. I am six, seven. I am a six, seven. This one is cocked. Let's reroll that. Six, seven, and it's an eight, so I make an eight for an attack. One for my defense. Uh, two for my attack, so one in. So I am one in. Mm -hmm. One in plus two d6. There's a chance I might die. Uh, that is two in. Two in. And one poison. Two in and one poison. I'm alive with one more point. So he's dealing two damage plus two d6. <laughs> is that weapon plus one? No, nothing. So uh, that weapon is minus one. So that's uh, ten. Two damage to my guy and Lee. Activating Yori and going to the objective. Activating my Temple Bushi again. Mm -hmm. Okay, so three dice and I'm going on all attack. On defense? Two on defense for him. I make five, so I'm dealing one damage. So that's enough. So one damage and yeah, one damage, so that just kills him. He's going to die anyway at the end of turn due to poison, but I just don't want my guy to get ganged up there if he activates Ran. And it's now his activation. I got an error over there. Uh, well, uh, Arata is supposed to be impetuous, so he was supposed to have activated him first before Jung, Mar Jung Marie. Yes. Okay, but anyway, we'll just go with the game. Uh, that's why you should make sure that you don't hide your models behind forests <laughs> so you don't forget about them. But anyway, he's activating Arata now. We'll just continue on with the game. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then we'll see what happens. He's activating Arata, moving around. And to attack, attack my Temple Bushi is supposedly tired right So now. he's making sure he's boosting one dice and uh, using unblockable against my measly two dice. So I have two on defense. Oh, and I roll a seven and his attack is... <laughs> five, six. Five, however, he is unblockable. So unblockable removes this one. So I'm now only at four. Four, four. Five. So dealing one damage. Dealing three. one damage. One damage to my guy plus his damage roll. Let's clear the dice out here. Damage roll. One damage. Uh, Dealing one damage. Plus and, one. And I have bleed, I believe. Yes, you have bleed. And okay, you're going so, to have bleed again. Yeah, so uh, my Temple Bush is dying at the end of activating Chiyo because you must play for objectives. I'll move five. I'll move right here. Base contact with that shrine, and I am done. But I think he will outpray me. So I'm going to pray using Yori. So I gain. And he's praying and he gains uh, three points, three I believe, points. from that one. Mm -hmm. And I will pray. So I also have three points, points. and I'm now exhausted. Mm -hmm. And it's all his activations now. Okay, I think I'm calling it. I'm only left with my. Uh, Chiyo named Temple Bushi left and all he has to do is uh, keep on praying in this area while he can use his other models to uh, tie up my guys so I won't be able to pray. So I think that's the game and that is uh, Carlos' first uh, win with his Jung. His first game, I think. Yeah, his first game with Jung, but first I made a mistake on the third game. Turn. With Arata June. was supposed to be activating first. But uh, I think he has a chance to kill the Temple Bushi. But yeah, then I would have been able to uh, make Itsunagi stand. Yeah. 
uh, as my first activation because he had to use uh, Arata first instead of uh, Jungmari, correct? Yes, Jungmari. Uh, but that's fine. Uh, during my first few games, I've been forgetting to use my impetuous models too. But anyway, that's the game and hopefully you got a view on how uh, Jung plays. Okay, playing with uh, Queen of the Waves. Yeah, uh, Queen of the Waves, making my guys impetuous and shooting uh, tricks over there with those flank guys. So, uh, not bad. Uh, nice game. Nice game. Too. Okay, nice game. Thank you. Thank you.